Sure, no sweat. Nice to be on the open road. Good neighbor was starting to wear out its welcome. Sounds like you had a rough time of it back there. Rough? That's putting it mildly. Let's put it this way. Can't get much rest when you're sleeping with one eye open. Still, it was the best place for me to set up shop. Diamond City's goons would have run me out of town, and wandering the Commonwealth alone isn't the brightest plan when you're hard up for caps. Caps are pretty important. You're goddamn right they are. Right now, I need every cap I can get. Are caps really that important to you? I don't have much of a choice. Uh, I don't usually go around sharing stuff like this, but you've been pretty straight with me, so I'm gonna be straight with you. It's those two asshole, <clears throat> Those two idiots you saw me talking to at the third rail. Winlock and Barnes. They've been hounding me for months, and it's been driving off clients. No one wants to touch me once they learn I used to run with the gunners. And I figured if I could get enough caps together, maybe I could buy them out. I wouldn't trust those guys, even if you paid them off. Yeah, I'm right there with you. Winlock and Barnes have a small army of gunners with them at all times. They might decide to just keep the caps and put a bullet in my head for good measure. If I set up a place to meet them, I'm sure they'd roll in with everyone they've got. Unless... Maybe you and I could pay them a little visit and put an end to them before they realize what's going on. Before you get that look on your face, let me just say that I wouldn't even be asking if I didn't trust you. If you need my help, I'm there. Wow. I don't know what to say. Truth is, I haven't been able to rely on anyone since I was a kid. Everyone I've met has either tried to rip me off or plant a knife in my back. But you... You're different. We see eye to eye on almost everything. And I have a funny feeling you actually care about what happens to me. That's why I asked for your help. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna make this easy on you. If you feel like helping me with this, head over to the Mass Pike Interchange and we'll take them down. If you don't, I'm not going to hold it against you. Either way, thanks for hearing me out. It's nice to know that you care. Let's take him down. Got it. Head over there. Sure, no sweat.
What a letdown. Look alive. What's up? <clears throat> well, this should send a message to the gunners to stay off my back. I'm sure they heard you loud and clear. Definitely. For the gunners, it's always about the bottom line. And they just lost this entire way station, and that cost them big. Besides, they have no way of knowing I was involved. Anyway, I guess I owe you a favor now. After all, you hired me, but I'm the one that dragged you out here. You don't owe me. You clearly needed the help. Sure, but I like everything to remain nice and even. And you're one up on me. Tell you what, I'm going to give you back the caps you paid me in Good Neighbor. I'll still stick with you because that was part of the original deal, but now we're even. There you go. I guess we're done here. Lead on, boss.